we will be discussing a few pieces of useful bathroom equipment. They will include an elevated toilet seat for use in getting on and off the toilet, a shower chair for use in a walk-in type shower, a tub transfer bench for use in a tub type shower, and grab bars for use in getting out of all types of showers, and a handheld shower. To help with the toileting, we recommend an elevated toilet seat. This elevated toilet seat comes with grab bars. There is also a version that does not have the grab bars, simply the elevated seat. They're very easy to install. Lift the lid, insert the toilet seat, and then this knob can be screwed in to securely lock it in place. This elevated toilet seat allows for ease in sitting. It also provides something solid to push off of to come to a stand. Another item worth mentioning is the 3-in-1 commode. It is called a 3-in-1 because it is one piece of equipment that can work in three ways as an elevated toilet seat, as a shower chair, and also as a bedside commode. As an elevated toilet seat, it simply slides over the toilet with the seat up. The legs can adjust for height. It has a lid that can come up. This piece of equipment functions very similar to the elevated toilet seat we just discussed. It gives you something to grab onto to come to a seated position. In addition, it gives you something to push off of to come to a stand. When a 3-in-1 is used as a shower chair, it must be used in a walk-in shower. A bathtub shower typically does not have the size to accommodate one. In addition, make sure that the walk-in shower that you're using it in also has enough room to accommodate its large size. When using a walk-in type shower, there are a few important things to remember. One is to have grab bars installed. This allows you something secure to hold on to when entering and exiting the shower. The other is the shower chair. We've already discussed the bedside commode type shower chair, and this shows you the basic standard shower chair. It is important to have a backrest and to have the adjustable legs. This provides you both. When entering, you will grab a grab bar to step in, and it is important to have a grab bar on the side wall to give you something to hold on to when you sit and when you come to a stand. While exiting, it is important to remember not to grab anything that might move. A couple examples of this are the shower door, which could cause a fall. In addition, towel racks. People typically grab these for support and they are not secure enough. If it is tempting to grab a towel rack for support, you may want to replace it with a grab bar. You could still throw the towel over the grab bar, but yet it is something secure in the wall to hold on to. Now if someone has a bathtub type shower and can step over the edge of the tub, it works much in the same way as a walk-in shower. You'll still want the grab bars to use one on the wall when sitting and standing off the shower chair and another on the side wall to use to step in and out. You'll also want to make sure you have a shower chair. If a 
standard shower chair is too large for your tub, many people like to use a patio chair. It works fine. It has armrests and a backrest. Another important point when using a bathtub shower is it is helpful to remove shower doors and replace them with a shower curtain. This allows more room to get in and out of the tub. Next we will talk about a tub transfer bench. As you can see, it is a bench that extends out over the edge of the tub. The advantage to this is it allows someone to sit with a backrest and a side grab bar, scoot in and lift their legs into the tub without having to step in. It has a crease in the tub that a shower curtain can slide through so the water does not go out into the floor and one can still use a shower curtain. Another handy item to have in a shower is a handheld shower. I highly recommend having one with an on-off switch on the handheld device itself. This way someone can adjust their water temperature and pressure, turn it off on the handheld device while getting in and out of the shower and they don't need to have the water constantly hitting them while in the shower. Whether in a walk-in shower or a tub shower, it is always important to have a non-skid surface on the bottom of the shower floor. Another handy item to have in the bathroom is a nightlight for use during nighttime trips to the toilet. <laughs>